Hi everyone, Alan here of the Alan Kane's Daily Blog. Yeah, um, yeah, I'm just having a walk, I'm just having a walk home at the moment. Um, is, you know, I'm going to basically say something now. Um, Blackburn with Darwin. Yeah. What a mess. They're basically, they're basically building on green land. And, well, to be truthful, you're not supposed to do that. Because what you're supposed to do, right, and Salford's getting it, as I said, I'm pointing out Salford once again. Salford's getting it right. What Salford City Council has turned around, turned around and said, right, no, no building, right, in the centre of Salford is to be less than 16 floors high. So, of late, Salford's put in really tall buildings up. But they're not, they're not glass, they're not glass constructions, they're basically um, the old style concrete ones. But, Salford's doing it right. That's it. And basically, Blackburn's town planners have got it all wrong. What they basically have to do is get as many people in a, as a smaller place space because if you don't if you don't the green space around it is going to cost you more to build on it really does like I said putting four or five bedroom houses there I'm sorry guys but you're building on you're building on land because the footprint the footprint of waiting my GP right um yeah because if you do it that way Oh, have I got the f flats? Have I got the flats? Hopefully. Yeah, there we go. That is what you should be doing. That is what you should be doing. Not poke your little houses. Because... If you go upwards, right, you can get twice as many, twice as many houses, uh, of dwellings in a smaller space, which under Ag Agenda 2130 is required. Yep.
So, no worries. Yep, so, yeah, black pin, you're doing it wrong. <laughs> yeah, you're doing it wrong. What you should be doing is going upwards, not outwards, because you're taking up valuable land, um, of which which the government wants to, you to plant trees on. Yes, the government wants Blackburn with Darwin to plant more trees. More trees. Oh, are they doing the... Sounds like they're doing the garden at the... Uh, thing. At the church, yeah, they want, they want uh, the the, the, count, the borough council to plant more trees on that land instead of building the houses on it. Yeah, well, there you go, Blackburn Council. Your building policy, your building policy is pretty wrong, really. And then uh, you'll be right. Why is that Dr. Serge is having his grass cut? And uh, yeah. That's the sound of the ambulance. Well, the thing is, that's tower blocks, blocks of flats, has been proved in planning planning terms the best way to do it. But what you have to do is you've got to get the building materials right. Yes, concrete does give, concrete does give a lot of gases off, but it's damn bloody good stuff. If it's good enough for, uh, for the Romans, it's good enough for us. Yes, <coughs> yes, it, concrete has actually been down since BC times. So, yeah, well, I'm going to go home, get in before it rains, because that's what it's predicted to do today. An absolute chuck it, bucket it down. So I'm going to go, go home, get in, and I'm going to basically, you know, put this video up as soon as I get in. Also, I'm going to post it on my Facebook page. Yeah, it's like what I said. They shouldn't be building out on... Building out on... Uh... Oh, here we go. Here we go, it's starting to rain. Yeah, this is the reason why the climate is a bit crap. Because... You're building on land, but it's best if you're built upwards. London is, learn is learning its lesson. Five bedroomed, five bedroomed flats are the ways to go. Like 
one thing I'd like to see happen so that people don't have to use vehicles, cars, is stick a rail station underneath it. That that is what I was looking at for Mayfield. You know. So Manchester do it. Right, I'm going to stop the video now.